what's going on guys so in today's video we're gonna, we're about to go get tuned by alpha speed now i've heard countless very good things about alpha speed so i'm gonna switch over to alpha speed today and i'm just gonna show you guys the whole process of it but of course can't get a tune without the blank slate so i picked me up a little stock ecu 2013 manual shout out to hunter right on facebook um came through with a two-day shipping on the ecu you're the goat thank you if you're seeing this <laughs> but yeah let's go through this tune in now down here my boy Harold's taking care of the tune and if they want to contact you about a tune they just in DM me on Instagram, uh, on Instagram I'll speed up my... all right there you go I'll also throw it up on the screen so you guys know where to go crazy I washed it in a bit, so <laughs> dirty. even got the power decoded everything putting down 482 Single walk any Genesis I know. Damn. He put the right turn signal and yeah. then he decided to go straight. I guess. So with the Alpha Speed can tune, the launch control is set at 3500 and right now I'm just having Harold turn it up to 4000. Just have that extra bangs and stuff. So that's what's going on right now. Damn, it spins a lot. Let me do another quick one. Damn. <laughs> Shit. 
It's gonna be hard to fucking spin those federals. Like, I had a, one of my boys, he had federals on his 600 horsepower single turbo T35 and he was hooking, bro. Not yeah. digs, but he would hook like 20s yeah. or 40s, which is like, you're not gonna get this car to like spin the federal. It yeah. sounds like a little funny like when it goes up it's like uh... It sounds better than the other one for sure Yeah Of course on the way back we drove into the rain I don't know man Florida sucks right now it's probably I think it's um What do you call it? Thunderstorm season or storm season And yeah I pretty much can't film anything Because sometimes it just rains all day The roads are wet whatever I need to do I need to drive and be outside so bear with me guys sometimes like there's just gonna be those days where i can't record anything because of the weather outside i'm not sure if i mentioned this but he did raise the rpm no the launch control what the hell to um 45,000. i asked him to raise it to four but i guess they can only do it in increments of like you know plus 500 so i guess he couldn't do just the 4,000. It had to be 4,500 for some odd reason, but um, it sounds pretty mean, like the two-step. I'll, I'll do it right now. That's crazy, oh my god. To be honest with you, I thought having the launch control set at 45 was gonna be like a lot of load and like maybe like, <sighs> oh, sorry about that. Maybe it might be too much for the engine, you know, but damn, that shit is loud. And you see, like me, I don't race. Honestly, that's why I wasn't planning on getting launch control. I just never was really a fan of it because it just sounded like a whole bunch of noise, but um wow that thing does sound really mean you know some people might want to call me a racer in the comments but damn you can't even lie that shit sounds good so pretty much what harold does is you have to bring your car to him with a stock ecu and what he does is he takes what his like cantoon file he puts it over on your car by plugging plug it it plugging it in speak through the obd port and then um, the tune uploads, then you go, you know, take it for a little test drive, everything works, bada beam, bada boom. That's for a custom, that's for a can tune, so it's pretty simple. So guys, that's gonna wrap up this video, and I'm gonna make the Alpha Speed Tune review a whole separate video. Uh, I just didn't want to make this video too long. So be on the lookout for that video coming soon. Um, yeah, and I also wanna say thank you guys. The last video I put out, we hit 300 views in about two days, and that's astronomical to me because usually to get 300 views, it takes me about maybe like five days a week sometimes. But man, we are growing strong. We're sitting at 441 subscribers right now. So each and every person who subscribes, thank you, I love you. And if you haven't subscribed already, I'm gonna hit you with it right now. Go down and hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and turn the post notifications on. Thank you guys for watching again. You're amazing. Take care.